If you're looking to buy cheap and custom controllers, be sure to check out singegaming.com and use discount code CSHD for 5% off. What's going on guys, Casual Savage here. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a muzzle flash on Sony Vegas Pro 11, 12 and 13. So, I'm going to be showing you what I'm going to make right now. So yeah, I did use that in my Q&A, and let's get into it. So you will need three things. The actual gun muzzle flash, and a gunshot, and of course the footage you're going to be shooting with. So, let's get into it. So I've shortened my clip down to where I actually want it to, and you can see I do use a water gun in this. And I do apply a recoil in this, but I've actually done too much, but that does not matter. So... That's when I stop, so I'm just going to stop that there. So now what we want to do, if we zoom in, now go keyframe, so click in here, or you can just click your arrows, until you actually take your first shot. So mine is about there, so bang, right there. And I'm going to press M to lay a marker down like that. So that'll tell me where my first shot is. And then I'm going to just go across and do that for all of them. And that looks like it's it, I have got all of them out now, so this is each time I take a shot. So as you can see here, I take 5 shots in total. Now next thing, you want to right click here and click insert a video track, because this is where you have to add in the uh, flash. So just drag it in. Now you can see straight away it's like that, but what you have to do, just go ahead and click here, and just click add. You can see here the black background has now been removed, so what you do, click the event pattern crop and just position it and just position it where you actually want it to happen so it's about there for me it looks good and oh it's about probably there it looks about good enough and yeah let's put it the other way around so the smoke is actually on this side that's the good thing about this it does come with smoke as well uh, and that to me actually looks good enough about there and now once you play through you can see so it's a bit laggy I'm just going to turn the quality down so you can see this so you can see the smoke actually comes back as well so you can see this I'll show you one more time so it's actually a bit dark so what you can do you can go to brightness and contrast and you can go and make it a bit darker so there we go, you can see the flash is now coming up a bit better. And just mess around with it until you think it's good enough for you. So, if we make it go too bright, you can see you can't see that good. And contrast, I want to make it a bit better like that. And we'll do that. So now if we go through it again, you can see it now comes out much better. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to press, press on it and press Control c to copy the file and now I'm going to paste them on each gunshot so the way you do that you click where it is and click Control v so now once we go through we can see that there is now a gunshot on each one and it does look pretty realistic now the next thing to do of course is add the gun effect itself so right click here and click add audio track here and here we go so this is what the gunshot will sound like for me Let's just put it there so so it's actually a pistol and yeah now what you have to do is just check if it's in the right position for you to me that looks correct so I'm just going to shorten it down and I'm going to copy and paste it for each one again now let's go back and play it. Now to me that actually looks pretty realistic and since we are using Sony Vegas 
it is a pretty good thing that we can do with it. Because Sony Vegas obviously isn't the best to do this on, probably After Effects or Premiere Pro because they do have loads of good presets. But yes, yeah, being Casual Savage here, I hope you've liked the video. Right now, I'm going to show you the full thing when it's rendered. So that is it, that is how you do it, it is really simple as you can tell, and there's just one more thing I want to say before I go, everything that you will need will be in the description, now of course if you have a different gun, for example a shotgun, all you need to do for that is just search on YouTube, gunshot for a shotgun, and then of course you can use any of them because they're going to obviously be non-copyrighted because they're only a snip clip, which is about 4 to 5 seconds, so it'll be alright, don't worry about copyright. And another thing, I'm also going to give away this banner, I'm actually going to upload it to my channel, I'm not 100% sure if you will actually like it, so that is why I've been a bit hesitant about uploading it, to so let me know, do you like this banner, do you want it, I'll upload it for you if you want it, and also yeah, be sure to follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook page because I do post technology and gaming news on there daily, and also be sure to check out my gaming channel where I do try to upload daily, and yeah. I now also have Snapchat where I just show you what I do throughout my day, so you can go ahead and follow me on that. So yes, it's been Casual Savage here. I hope you've liked this video. Please subscribe, rate, and peace.